So we're continuing on The Merchant of Venice, Act 2, Scene 4. Enter Graciano, Lorenzo, Salarino, and Solano. So Lorenzo first. Nay, we will slink away in supper time, disguise us at my lodging, and return, all in an hour. No, we'll sneak away at supper time, disguise ourselves with masks at my house, and come back in an hour. Graciano, we have not made good preparation, but we haven't made any preparations. Salarino, we have not spoken yet of torchbearers. We haven't even talked about who will be our torchbearers. Salano, tis vile, unless it may be quaintly ordered and better in my mind not undertook. The masquerade party might turn out terribly if we don't manage things carefully. I think it's better to call it off. Lorenzo, tis not but four o'clock. We have two hours to furnish us. Enter Lancelot with a letter. Friend, Lancelot, what's the news? So Lorenzo, he's pretty much saying this. It's only four o'clock now. We have two hours to get ready. Lancelot enters with a letter. Lancelot, what's going on? Lancelot, giving Lorenzo the letter. And it shall please you to break up this. It shall seem to signify. He gives Lorenzo the letter. If you don't mind opening this letter, you can find out for yourself. Lorenzo, I know the hand. In faith, tis a fair hand, and wider than the paper it writ on is the fair hand that writ. I recognize the handwriting. It's beautiful handwriting, and the beautiful hand that wrote this letter is wider than the paper it's written on. <laughs> Graciano, love news, in faith. I bet it's a love letter. Lancelot to Lorenzo, by your leave, sir. To Lorenzo, may I, may I be excused, sir? So Lancelot, you know, he's he's now working for them. So Lorenzo, whither goest thou? Where are you going? Lancelot, marry, sir, to bid my old master the Jew to sup tonight with my new master the Christian, to invite, to invite my former boss the Jew to dine tonight with my new master the Christian. Lorenzo, giving Lancelot money. Hold here, take this, tell gentle Jessica I will not fail her. Speak it privately, go, gentlemen. Will you prepare you for this mask tonight? I am provided of a torchbearer. Exit Lancelot, the clown. He, so Lorenzo, Lorenzo gives Lancelot money and says, Hold on, take this, tell Jessica I won't fail her. Tell her in private. Go, gentlemen, get ready for the masquerade tonight. I have someone who can be my torchbearer. So Lancelot exit. Salarino, hey, Mary, I'll be gone about it straight. All right, I'll go get things ready. Salenio, and so will I, me too. Lorenzo, meet me in Graciano at Graciano's lodging some hour hence. Meet me in Graciano at his house in about an hour. Salarino, tis good we do so. It's good we're doing this. Ex Exuant Salarino and Salano. Salarino and Salano exit. Graciano, was not that letter from fair Jessica? Wasn't that letter from Jessica? Lorenzo responds, I must needs tell thee all. She hath directed how I shall take her from her father's house. What gold and jewels she is furnished with. What pages suit she hath in readiness. If ever the Jew her father come to heaven, it will be for his gentle daughter's sake. And never dare misfortune cross her foot unless she do it under this excuse that she is issued to a faithless Jew. Come, go with me. Gives Graciano the letter, per you, per use this as thou goest, fair Jessica shall be my torchbearer, exuant. So this is what Lorenzo's pretty much telling um, Graciano. I have to tell you everything. She's told me how I can get her out of her father's house. She's also told me what gold and jewels she owns. And she's described the page's uniform she's keeping to wear as a disguise. If her father ever goes to heaven, it'll be because his daughter's so good. She'll never be punished with bad luck unless it's because her father is an unbelieving Jew. Come with me. He gives Graciano the letter. You can look this letter over as you go. Beautiful Jessica will be my torchbearer. So a page is a young male servant. <laughs> And she described the page's uniform she's keeping to wear as a disguise. So I guess he's going to take her to the masquerade, but she's going to be dressed up as a male servant. So they exit. And that's the end of Act 2, Scene 4. They all get together. Lancelot comes through, sees all the friends together. Solano, Salarino, um, Lorenzo, and somebody else, I guess, uh, O'Graciano. And it's pretty much a letter from Jessica. And they're all getting ready for the masquerade tonight, etc., etc.
Anyway, uh, peace.